Hello friends, if you are having trouble with CAT VARC, then please try Bodhi Prep's VARC course designed by me. For details, read the message in the video description below. So let's solve this question on uh, Tita para jumble and we have one, two, three, four, five sentences given here and we have to arrange these sentences to form a coherent paragraph. Now let's try to find the opening sentence. The first job that we must do while solving Tita para jumble's question is to find the opening sentence. Now if you look at sentence number one, it says this has huge implications. So because of the presence of the pronoun this, we are not very clear as to what does it refer and therefore one is not likely to to be the opening sentence right and when I come to the st statement 2 it says the placebo effect is when an individual's medical condition so basically it defines what exactly the placebo effect is so when you are introducing some kind of concept so you basically open the idea and this very much looks like an opening so statement 2 looks like an opening paragraph we can shortly statement 2 unless we find something better now let's go to three. The placebo effect is not solely based on. So again, statement three cannot be the opening sentence because we already statement three says the placebo effect is not solely based on this. That means and it also has the word however. So this cannot be an opening sentence because we must define placebo effect first and then write statement three. So three is not so good as an opening sentence as two is. Let's go to four. That the mind has the power to trigger biochemical changes because the individual believes that a given drug or intervention will be effective. Could empower chronic patients through the notion so that the mind has something this belief could empower chronic patients through the notion of our body's capacity for self-healing so this speaks about the body's capacity for self-healing but again uh, we we don't know how this how this i mean this also can be an opening sentence but we must wait until we find the right sequence Statement 5 says placebo effects are now studied not just as foils for real interventions but as a potential portal into the self-healing powers of the body. So statement 5 says self-healing powers of the body and statement 4 says uh, uh, chronic patients through the notion of our body's capacity for self-healing. That means basically uh, the placebo effect must come first and after we have explained something about the placebo effect then we must speak about the self-healing powers of the body and only then we can have statement 4 that basically means the placebo effects idea should give way to the self-healing powers because placebo effects are now studied not as this but as potential portal into self-healing powers so once we have discussed the idea of placebo effects then we can gradually go into the self-healing powers of the body that means 4 definitely will not come first we should have 2 at the start of the paragraph so we have shortlisted 2 statement as the opening sentence and it is the right opening sentence because it opens the idea of the placebo effect it says here the placebo effect is when when an individual's medical condition or pain shows signs of improvement based on a fake intervention that has been presented to them as a real one and used to be regularly dismissed by researchers as a psychological effect. So basically the placebo effect is when an individual's medical condition or pain shows signs of improvement based on what a fake intervention. This is what the idea says. And if you look at this fake intervention word, this fake intervention has basically been, uh, been carried forward in statement 5. It says here placebo effect are now studied not just as foils for real in, uh, interventions but as potential portals so basically the uh, it is not just as foils for real interventions in the sense that placebo effect is no longer uh, considered as a fake intervention but as a potential portal into the self-healing powers that means we we speak about two that is the intervention part then we basically say that it is not just this but it is something more than that and what is it it's a potential portal into the self-healing powers of the body right and what can come after this so that the mind has the power to trigger biochemical changes because the individual believes that a given drug could empower chronic patients through the notion of our body's capacity for self healing so placebo effects are now studied not just as foils but as the potential for self-healing powers of the body and that the mind has the power to trigger now this self-healing basically is happening through what through the mind so the self-healing idea has been further elaborated in statement number four. It says here, uh, statement number four says the mind, that the mind has the power to trigger biochemical. Now what basically is this all? This is nothing but the self-healing power. That the mind has the power to trigger biochemical changes uh, 
because the individual believes that a given drug or intervention will be effective could empower so the, the fact that the mind has the power to do something could empower chronic patients through the notion of our body's capacity for self-healing the placebo effect is not solely based on believing in treatment however that means there is something more to it and what is this as the clinical setting in which treatments are administered is also paramount so the clinical setting is also paramount and where is it given it is given in statement one this has huge implications for the healthcare system so the clinical setting given in statement three is basically elaborated in statement number one it says the placebo effect is not solely based on believing in treatment there is something more as a clinical setting in which treatments are administered is also paramount and what is that clinical setting this is basically in statement one this has huge implication for the healthcare system which is nothing but the clinical setting where depleted resources and time lead to patients rotating in and out of doc doctor's office oftentimes receiving minimal care or concern so basically the sep the paragraph starts with placebo effect and then it speaks about the self healing powers of the mind of the body and how it happens is given in four and from there basically you take a u turn saying that well it is something there is something more to it and what is that the clinical setting which is there in three and finally it says here that the, that that the placebo effect has huge implications for the healthcare system as it operates today where depleted resources and time lead to patients rotating in and out of doctor's office so basically the placebo effect because it has the self-healing power uh, it will have a huge implication for the healthcare system where you have depleted resources so that so so the entire paragraph speaks about the positivities of the placebo effect we start by explaining what that positivity is and gradually apart from the self-healing powers what are the other benefits which are given in statement 3 and 1 so 25431 is the right sequence